Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com, and today we're going to do another Android 101 series and show you how to set a song as a ringtone on your Android device. Okay, so the first question that always comes up when you're trying to set music as your ringtone is where do you get the music? Um, well, there's a lot of places to do it actually, especially in Android. But we're going to go to the market. And I'll show you real quick. Basically, just search for MP3 download, MP3 music download, any of those things will do. So you'll type in MP3 music download. Hit go. Okay, and you'll see there's a bunch of them that pop up. Uh, choose whichever one you want. Um, just be careful when you do. So I'm gonna choose this one, the top one. I know that it's been downloaded by a lot of people. Also, if you click the install button, you're gonna see what it accesses. Make sure you check that, because some of these are a little uh, shady programs. This one seems okay. It just wants internet access. It wants to make sure that the, the phone is on. Um, prevent it from sleeping. Modify delete USB storage, that's fine. It's not it's not accessing my contacts or anything that I really care too much about, so that's fine. We're gonna click OK and wait for that to install. Okay, so once we've downloaded that app, we're going to open it. And then you're gonna type in the name of a song, artist, or album in order to start downloading a song. So we're gonna do a song. Okay, and then we're gonna download that and wait for it to finish downloading. Okay, so once that's done downloading, we're gonna go back to the market and we're gonna search for a program called Ring Droid. It's one word. And click on that by the Ring Droid team and click install and wait for that to install. Okay, once that's done installing, we're going to open it. And it's gonna automatically find all of the music on our device. Uh, so we're gonna find our song that we downloaded, Beethoven here, tap on it. It's gonna load it into the program, so we can hit play to hear where it is. Okay, and now we're gonna use these sliders to select the part of the song that we want. Generally, you don't want to start at the beginning of the song. Now with this song, it doesn't matter, but songs that might have words in them, etc. Uh, you might get an intro, which means you won't get the part that you want. You're just gonna get the music in the beginning. So you can move these around and hit play to see where the actual ringtone is going to start. Now you can also extend it by pulling this out. Most ringtones, you should make about 30 seconds. So you can see down here, I've got 17 to 42, so we need 17 to 47-ish. And that's a good length for our ringtone. Once we're ready, we have the ones that we want, we're going to hit save. And now we're gonna select the type. So if this were a notification, um, we would change this to notification, if it's an alarm, an alarm, uh, ringtone, ringtone. So since this is a ringtone, we're gonna leave it just like that and hit save. Now you do have the option to make it your default ringtone. This means that it's going to be the ringtone for every single person that calls you. Or you can select assign to contact, um, which will allow you to choose a contact and set it for that individual. We don't want to do either of that though. We're going to hit close. And we're going to show you how to manually set the ringtone. So hit menu, settings, sound, and then we're going to go to phone ringtone and we're gonna scroll down to the one that we just downloaded, which is somewhere. Here it is, Beethoven, and select it. Now this is gonna make it the ringtone for every single person that calls us, so I click OK. Now if we wanted to set it for an individual contact, um, or set different ringtones for individuals, we're gonna to go to Contacts, tap the person that we want, Menu, 
options and then you'll see ringtone up here at the top. So we're gonna tap ringtone and then select the ringtone that we want. And this will make it just for that person as opposed to everybody that calls us. And then you can hit home once that's done. Okay, now we're gonna show you how to set a notification. So we're gonna go back into our ring droid program. And so we wanna do the same song. And uh, since it is a notification, we don't want it to be, it starts at 15 seconds here. We don't want it to be 15 or 30. We don't even want it to probably be five. So we're gonna scroll this down to maybe about four seconds. Not even, I would even say maybe three seconds. And then now we're gonna save that. And this time we're gonna select notification instead of ringtone. And notifications are anything like the messaging program, the Gmail program, your email program, those kind of things. So we're gonna hit save. No, we're not gonna set it automatically. Okay, and now to set it as our notification, menu settings, sound, and you'll see notification ringtone. Select that and select the song and that'll make all of your notifications, your email, your messaging, all that stuff will be this sound. If you wanna set it specifically for one program, you open that program, so messaging for instance, menu, settings, and we're gonna to go to notifications, select ringtone, and select it from here. And there's that for that. Now let's say you want it to do it for Gmail. Open Gmail, more settings, and this works the same with the regular email program as well. Select ringtone, and find our ringtone, and hit OK. And that's it. That's how to set it. Thank <laughs> you.